Too hot to do anything. My mad skills are leeching out of me. I can feel it. My mojo isn't sweat proof. Can't you fan any faster? Ah, you're hot, but I'm hotter. <laughs> I can't be getting a cold in this heat. Get you! Water? You're the only girl I'd risk catching some heinous virus from. <laughs> That's, uh, sweet, Trent. Thanks. It's probably just allergies. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Sweet! Think I just scored a few extra bonus points. And we're back to zero on the relationship scale. Not that anyone's counting. I mean, besides Trent. My cranium! Take it easy. Guns are loaded with blanks. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure one of them is. <laughs> Since there's no beat in the heat, we're going west this week. There's a town meeting at high noon. Be there or I'll drive your dead beats out of town. <gasps> if you're driving us out of town, can we go to the mall? Oh, darn humidity! What you think you're looking at? Nothing to see here! <laughs> Do you see something wrong with my hair? Not from where I'm standing. Listen up, partners. In any good western, there are heroes, outlaws, horses, and pretty dames. The hero defeats the outlaw, then rides off into the sunset on the horse. What about the pretty dames? None of your beeswax. <laughs> Just messing with ya. They usually hang out in the saloon during the bar brawl. Bar brawl. Cool. <laughs> Whoa! Awesome reenactment, Harold. Uh, most brawls do end up with the loser in the water trough. Back home, my peeps and I look out for each other. Harold may be small and strange, but that boy is still my peep. I've got my eye on Duncan. Oh, yeah. Feels good. Enough with the man candy. All eyes on me. Time for your first challenge. No cowboy worth spitting at will go one day without saddle practice. Time to saddle up! <laughs> That's the best steed we could afford? You want a five-star hotel and champagne and caviar for breakfast? I gotta cut somewhere. It's perfect. Don't change a thing. Oh, I love Horthy's. Justin told me I looked like one. He's so great. I spent three summers at Medieval Steve's Medieval Camp. We learned to joust, ride horses, and how to look manly in tights. It's harder than it looks. Who says a western has to end with a guy and his horse? This is the movies. The guy always gets the girl. Meaning me. You call this a challenge? Not so fast. You cowboys and cowbabes are gonna have to mount the steed from up there. Not there. Way up there. Since the gaffers won last week, they go first. Don't worry. Our unpaid interns have assured us it's safe. No, no, no! Ah! Looks safe to me. <laughs> We won last week. Why do we have to go first? Because I said so. And I'm your host, Chris McClay. Achoo! Guys, I really think I'm coming down with something. Don't worry. We'll help you up the ladder. Uh, guys, Gwen really is sick. In her condition, she'd probably fall right off the platform and land on that poor horse. Oh. What was that? Stupid. Wish me luck. You yeah, can do it. You can do it. Let's go. We're going to need a new team captain. I heard that. Oh, 
Break a leg, Gwen! Break a leg? That's what Trent says to me as I'm about to plummet a hundred feet? Stupid, stupid! I can't do it! Ah, ah, yeah! Acceleration equals mass times the gravitational constant occasional equational. Not good, people! Not good! You okay, girl? Gwen! Uh, thanks. Just watch my left Ow! arm! Stupid, stupid, stupid! Oh! That was awesome, Gwen! Gaffer's one, grips, you're up! It's not like things can get any worse. Oh. Or maybe they can? Glad it wasn't me. Gaffer's one, grip, zip. Harold, you're up. Oh. Wicked! Oh. Way to pad the saddle, Duncan. I think you broke my coccyx. Gaffer's three, grip, zip. Nice effort, Owen, my man. If horses can bend, so can the rules. Grips are now on the board with one. Uh, hey, Owen oh, cheated. So What's that about? Totally cheated. Oh. Yeah, baby. Horse jumping rules. <laughs> Not the electrical wires. Oh. Uh, Chris, you are going to send someone to help DJ, right? We here at Total Drama Action care about the health and welfare of our competitors. Furthermore, no animals were hurt in the making of this show. Uh, says right here, page 37 of my Gluteus Maximus modeling contract, I am forbidden from any form of jumping that might strain my, uh, assets. <laughs> Sorry. If I go to that big beauty parlor in the sky, don't let Heather have my hair, okay? Oh, no. Never. Uh, can I have your hair if you die? I don't think so. All right. Grips and gaffers are now tied at three each. It's up to you two to break the tie. Who wants to take one for the gaffers? After you, teammate. Is it that we have to stare at your navel all day? Put a shirt on. Oh, oh, right, right. Because we all love looking at those kumquats on your mall kiosk t-shirt. At least I have hair. Your afro is so big, it has its own gravity. Oh, I'll give you gravity. <laughs> ah! Where'd they go? Not there. Way up there. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> ha! Bet you're not laughing at my hair now. <laughs> well, I guess you showed her. And by her, I mean the entire viewing audience. <sighs> okay, okay. You don't got to get my dungarees all dusty. Looks like the teams are still tied at three apiece. To the next challenge for the tiebreaker, cowpucks. <laughs>